Hello Capricorn, how are my Capricorns doing? Hope you guys are doing well. Welcome back to another reading, guys. Please understand this is a general reading, so do take what makes sense for you and leave the rest for someone else, okay? Anything being said in a general reading can be switched up, okay? Interchangeable. So if something doesn't sound like you, then it could be your person's feelings, thoughts, intentions, okay? Um, yeah, and for cross us for cross watches out there please understand that um whatever is being said here could be something that the capricorn has done to you okay this is general just take what you need okay and just leave the rest all right so this is for you capricorn sun moon rising and venus please 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 like this video that way other capricorns can have the opportunity to see this reading all right what is coming towards capricorn this thing is not even like blowing me Stop playing with me. What the freak? Stop playing with me. Hmm. All right, whatever. It's my diffuser. Like, what the freak? <laughs> what is coming towards Capricorn in love, please? Capricorn. What is coming to the Capricorn in love? I feel like I need to take these two. Okay. So you have romance and staying right here. Okay. That's what we got. So whoever this freak is, they're staying right here. They're not going anywhere. Romance. Romance for the Capricorn. Romance. We like that. Now, um, you have trust at the bottom of the deck. So trust is a big thing, okay, for you or for this person. We have change of heart showing up. So let's see. Look at that doggy. You may have a dog like this. Is this a pug? I think that's a pug. So cute. I know, Capricorn. Let me just shut the hell up. <laughs> what is coming towards Capricorn in love? Please stay tuned, Capricorn. We will be uh, pulling these messages here, guys. Okay. What is coming towards Capricorn in love? Capricorn. Page of Swords. What is coming towards Capricorn in love? Capricorn. Come to Capricorn in love, please. Capricorn. Capricorn. We got the King of Cups. What is coming to Capricorn in love? Four of Wands. Wow. What's coming to Capricorn in love? Wow. Mm, I like this Capricorn. So you could be dealing with Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Taurus. I was hearing Libra. What's coming towards Capricorn in love? Mm. Okay. Eight of Wands. Okay, lovers. What's coming towards Capricorn in love. One's coming to Capricorn in love. Three more cards. Oh, what the hell? All right, hold on. What is coming to Capricorn in love? Let me get three more cards, Capricorn. Ooh, Ooh Capricorn shout out. All right, so you have death. I'm not sure if that came out in the reverse or not. You have the Six of Wands and the Page of Cups. So, you could be dealing with, yeah, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. With Scorpio kind of being the stronger one. Uh, Taurus, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But basically what I'm feeling here in Capricorn is you're going to have to think fast, okay? You're going to have to, um, you may be finding yourself a bit conflicted. I feel like you have a choice to make. And this has been kind of in Capricorn's readings for quite some time now. Um, the person you're dealing with, I'm going to tell you this right now. This is your twin flame. This person is your twin flame. Whether you believe it or not, this is your divine counterpart. Okay, you guys do have a very, very, very strong connection. And if you're trying to figure out why you feel so strongly attached to this person, this would be why. Um, so I'm here to confirm that for you, that there is definitely something spiritual about your connection. Well, this person, there's something past life. I'm hearing that you guys are like... Married in a past life, I'm hearing, this is no ordinary love. 
So this is no ordinary love. Now, here's the thing, Capricorn. <laughs> I'm really hearing, I know this is going to sound crazy, but for some of you, this is someone who's planning to propose to you. So don't be surprised if the, the question gets popped here. Will you marry me? Okay. Um, you do have the Hierophant here. Yeah. Some of you could be expecting marriage proposal. Facts. Now, for others of you, this may be someone, obviously, the person in question is showing up as the King of Cups. This is someone who obviously is capable, capable of giving you that, you know, that commitment, that uh, emotional um, commitment as well that you want, Capricorn. For sure, with the King of Cups, this is someone who's looking for commitment. This is what they want. This is what they're all about. This could be someone who's a bit long distance from you. Um, at the center of the reading, you have the Eight of Wands. So this tells me that this is all about moving forward, okay? Whatever is about to happen may ha happen unexpectedly, okay? This person is already spying on you, already watching you quite a bit with the Page of Swords. So death tells me that there's something that's changing in this relationship. So for those of you who are already in relationships, like I said, this person, your partner could be popping the question. So you guys are... are are no longer just living together or just boyfriend and girlfriend, husband and wife or fiance, whatever. Okay. So that's what I feel, Capricorn. Um, let's do a little clarifying. Bottom of the deck is the magician. And the magician is definitely someone who is full of surprises. Virgo, Gemini energy. Angels, what is the Page of Swords for Capricorn in love? What is the Page of Swords? Okay, let's flew out. Three of Coins. So whoever this person is, Capricorn, they do want to go to another level with you. This is what they want. Um, this is what they're going to be asking you for, okay? So ready or not, you got to make up your mind with it. This is what you want because you have Justice as well and Six of Wands. I mean, literally, I've pulled so far all of the marriage cards, all of the proposal cards. So it's very possible this person could be popping the question. Um, tell me about this Eight of Wands for Capricorn in love. I'm also hearing some of you. Okay, some people don't believe in love at first sight, but like you and this person may get married very quickly. Okay. Because it's just going to feel so right from the start. So... Especially if you're with your divine counterpart, you're going to feel that from the start. So don't be surprised if, you know, right away they go ahead and just propose to you or something. Yeah, whoever this person is, Capricorn, clarifying the Eight of Wands is the Knight of Coins. So this is someone who they don't want to, they don't want to drag their feet anymore. They don't want, basically this is someone who wants to move this forward quick. Things are going to move quickly here. What is the Eight of Wands for Capricorn in love? I mean, because it's like this person is so sure about you. Whether this is a new or a past person, whoever this person is, they're very sure about you. And they want to take this to another level. Um, so you're going to have to think fast. Um, tell me about this death for Capricorn. Things are about to move quickly. Yeah, Nine of Cups. Wish fulfillment wish fulfillment they don't want to be alone anymore two of cups two of cups yeah mm -hmm. this person the reason why is because the devil they already feel very attached to you they already feel like you're it you're the one i don't know uh capricorn i'm really getting the energy of this freak basically whoever this person is they just they already know you know, I'm hearing when you know, you know. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, what is the Page of Cups for Capricorn in love? The Eight of Swords reverse. So this person, before they did this, they, they, they were thinking quite a bit. They were in their head a lot. Page of Cups. But, yeah. Mm, Capricorn, someone could be popping the question, Empress. You could be pregnant. You could be pregnant. So maybe your partner or something wants to discuss, you know, having a kid with you, having a child, starting a family with you. This is what whoever this person wants. Um, bottom line, I mean, this is a very good reading, Capricorn. You guys literally have 
the best reading for the week. I definitely would say that here. I mean, seriously. Whoever this person is, I mean, this is the real deal. What is the four of wands for Capricorn? I mean, they feel like you guys are so good together. You have the world. What is the King of Cups? Well, we know what the King of Cups is. Some of you may have a choice to make. Okay. King of Cups. Some of you, if you could be in like a dead end marriage or something, this could be kind of like telling you to make that decision to get the hell out of there because the right person for you is around you. Or this person, even if they're involved, they're going to get out of there because they feel like you're the right person for them. You're the one. What is the King of Cups? Well, this flew out. Page of Cups. High Priestess. So whoever this person is, they have extremely deep feelings for you, Capricorn. Extremely. Um, so I don't know if you may sometimes get in your head and doubt the fool that this person loves you or something, but you shouldn't doubt it because they really do. Temperance. Yeah. Some of you could be literally jumping the broom. That's what I'm hearing. Jumping the broom. Because you have the fool here. Jumping that broom. And it was just 11-11, but I missed it. So I was going to say that for you guys' this reading. Um, so this Capricorn, literally this reading is all about commitment. It's all about making things official with you, being with you. This person's already obsessed, okay? <laughs> uh, they like you so much. This freak can't get enough of the Capricorn. <laughs> this freak can't get enough of Capricorn. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Well, what else do we need to see for Capricorn's love situation? What else, angels? We need to see the king of coins. Could be coming from a Taurus. Wow, the ace of coins. So, I mean, like I said, this person wants to provide for you. Knight of cups, page of coins. Wow, Capricorn. Whoa, damn. Some of you could have two people who want you, who, who are serious about you. Could be a water sign and an earth sign or an air sign. So take your pick, Capricorn. Capricorn can have whatever they want. Capricorn can have whatever they like. So basically with trust and staying right here, this person's not going anywhere, Capricorn. I mean, they want to solidify things, okay? Whoa. Capricorn. What does this person want their Capricorn to know? We have forgive me. We have worried you've moved on. Capricorn, what else? They say, can I take you out sometime? Capricorn. Do you remember our special times? I'm also hearing for some of you could be renewing vows to each other. Okay. I'll win your heart. Ooh, what was that? I seen something. Oh, there it goes. I miss you. Libra did pull this. Capricorn. Would you say yes to marrying me? So this person is thinking about putting a ring on it, Capricorn. They want to put a ring on the Capricorn, guys, okay? What if you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. And you have twin flames. I'm watching your every move. <laughs> Hmm. I plan to win you back, but I need you to be patient with me. I'm sorry if I come off careless. I'm just afraid of getting hurt again. I cry over you. Maybe this person was having money issues. My ego's in the way. I'm hearing that past tense, okay? I want a future with you, Capricorn. This is what I want. And I will never leave you again. So I don't know if this is someone who walked away from you. But uh, this freak is telling you. If they did walk away from you, Capricorn, it's kind of this energy I'm getting of them wanting to show you that they mean what they say. And sometimes, you know, people, when they want to show you that they mean what they say, they'll get on one knee and propose. Okay, just to show you that, yes, I'm in this. I really do want to be with you, okay? So you could take this freak seriously. Anyway, love you guys, Capricorn. Hope you guys enjoy. Talk to you guys soon.